out to the Vegas Tech community. It's Jennifer Goss coming to you from the Vegas Tech booth at South by Southwest. So this is my sign for Vegas Tech, by the way, that sign language read NT. So hope everyone's doing great. Can't wait to see you. All right, so now we're here with Tracky, another great company in the Vegas Tech ecosystem. Now, I could probably give you a demo of this product because we actually use it for the podcast, but yes. let me hear what you're actually saying to people that you're meeting here at South by. Well, thank you very much, by the way. Um, Tracky is a social collaboration platform, so it's task management and with a very social feel to it. But really beyond that, what we're talking about is that people become authoritative by sharing what they're getting done in life. Right. So we think like we have this separation of we work in private all the time, but then we push all these public updates on, on social networks. And that kind of seems like insincere. So why not share more of what you're working on and invite other people into your projects, find other people that you can relate with that are doers and find the other workers and so on. Um, Tracky is a platform that's actually open like Twitter where you can literally find anyone doing anything around the world, search for their kind of like their bio, their hashtag, and actually invite them into your projects. So it's kind of a unique way to open up the sense of work and what we're doing and being productive on a daily basis. Okay. And you guys are actually partially behind the 1% uh, doers campaign too, right, with Sarah? Yeah. So tell us how has that impacted anybody you've met here? Yeah, we, we really like the concept of, you know, rewarding people that are getting things done and that are trying hard, and it's another way to do that. Um, the 1% of doers campaign is about finding those people that really are kind of like maybe the 1% of the 20% that, that kind of right. do things and rewarding them and then letting their bosses know and like giving them a shot in the arm to say, you're doing a great job, like keep on doing it. You know, the world is noticing. Even if it's small and you're not a very social or public figure, to let them know that someone cares. And, you know, our back end, our platform is sort of kind of celebrating the doers, celebrating people that like to organize, be productive, to share, you know, that kind of thing, collaborate with others. And what's the most encouraging piece of feedback that you've gotten so far since being here? Well, we're getting a lot of aha, mo aha moments when we're talking to people. Yeah. So um, I think what I'm finding more than anything is that people's workflows are broken, but they aren't fixing them because they're so busy. And so what we're doing is like we're finding people that have needs and there's a lot of agencies that have come up and they're working, you know, as a team and then they're working with clients and some of them are global. And what they're saying is like, well, maybe we would have some sort of productivity platform for our team. But when it comes to working with our clients, we're using email and I had, I, you know, I've had people come to me and they're like, they're, they're fake crying because they're like, I'm dying in my email. My email is killing me. No, I know that pain. That's real crying. That's not. It, it, I know. I know that I had a guy just basically collapse into my arms yesterday and I was like, wow, this, this is a problem that needs to be fixed. So people's workflows, I think is like a big deal because we're like using nine apps a day to organize our work and our personal lives. And then we're busy all the time, we're always on, but it's like we're using all these different platforms. So when you can tell someone you can do basically email and collaboration and discussions and instant messaging and file sharing and now video collaboration or video conferencing with the Watch It 2 Playground integration all in one platform and you can invite anyone in and you can totally control what they see, meaning there's no visibility concerns, I'm not oversharing and I'm not undersharing. And then you have the private public elements, like that's... So we're getting that aha moment when there's actually, when they hear that there's a platform that actually can do all of that for them. And we're excited about that because our goal is to really help simplify people's lives, you know, help them to connect together and get more done, but you know, have more time to do some of the other stuff that they love to do. So that's yeah. offline. <laughs> all right. Well, I